Hello everyone, welcome to Other Levels. In this video, you will learn how you can create this amazing school management dashboard using Microsoft Excel without DBA codes. So let's start. Welcome to other levels. These are the color codes used in the design and the font type are Forte and Abadi. All the elements and images used in this dashboard are not from sources outside Excel, but rather from the Excel library. You can get all our templates fully customizable by visiting our online store. This is the database which we will build the report. In most cases, data are coming from different sources and several departments within the same organization. So in our designs, we try to use several types of data and tables. Once we use a table that contains all the data, and sometimes we prefer to be at separate data tables, whether the data is big or small, in order to teach you something important. Creating beautiful dashboards or reports doesn't require a specific data model, and you can always evolve your business into another level of creativity. Implementation of the dashboard will be on unfamiliar steps and must be followed as it is because I want to preserve the coordination and overall appearance of the dashboard when moving between them, so please watch carefully. At first, open a new sheet tab. We will start creating the first dashboard for high school. Remove the grid lines and headings, then insert a rounded rectangular shape. We will use PowerPoint to use the union feature to merge the two shapes together to become one new shape because we want to use gradient colors in it and do not want the color to be inconsistent. Set a line gradient color. In this design, we used many Excel Illustrator designs.
And we will start by searching for the corners. Insert text boxes and type the dashboard title using Forte font. In most of our templates, we use text boxes and not writing data in cells for ease of control and modification of texts. Now we will link each text box to the cell that contains its correct data on the database sheet tab. By typing in the formula bar, equals sign, and click on the correct cell and then press enter. Insert bus image from Excel Illustrator. Search in Excel Photo Library for pictures of kids but in PNG format to be a picture without a background. Change the image color into white color. Insert some image related to school or learning from Excel Illustrator.
Now we have reached the stage of designing the buttons that can be pressed to move between the dashboards in a creative and beautiful way. We will start the design stage first, and later we will complete the hyperlink settings. We will need two layers on top of each other, and start with the layer in the background, which will be in white color.
Search in Excel Photo Library for pictures of light, also in PNG format to be a picture without a background. A beautiful idea when choosing one of the dashboards is to show a light shining from behind. Now we will add pictures for all educational levels. If you like a picture and find it suitable, but it contains a background, you can use the feature to remove the background in Excel, as you will see now.
We will add an image for each educational stage, but it will appear only when you click on one of the buttons, so and to maintain general consistency, we will add it now, but we will hide it for later use at the appropriate time. Perfect! The design of the upper part of the dashboard is almost finished, and now we will start adding main data and charts. Today we are done with this and we will continue with the next video. I hope to see you well, God bless you all.